This is the math like quadratics always have two solutions, linear always have one. Did you know that it's false? Here's our example x squared plus 1 equals 0. I agree. When I go through this, I'm going to get no real solutions. Pretty cool. Now, when I have x minus 3 squared equals 0, I'm going to get one solution when I do that one. But here's the thing what happens when I go through this problem solving process and I just think I got to have either two solutions, I got to have one solution. What happens when I get 3x plus 5 equals 3x? For this one, I'm going to get no solutions. Why is that important? I need to get beyond just the trick that I'm either going to get two solutions or one solution. Or one of my favorites, if I have 2x plus 4 equals 2 times x plus 2, what is that going to give me? Infinite solutions. Therefore, I got to really think through when I'm doing this math that mathematics is richer than just having rules. Children deserve what? Rules that what? Last.